bright and early morning for sunrise and we are here at Gastelet. I'm gonna insert how you spell it down or what it's called down below because it's in Basque and it's very hard to pronounce. We drove 45 minutes from the Bilbao area to San Juan. It is a hike down from the parking lot, but it is just a little bit over a kilometer. San Juan is an islet located off the coast in the Basque Country that is connected by a man-made bridge, and on top of the island stands a hermitage dedicated to John the Baptist. This is where Dragonstone from Game of Thrones was filmed and inspired because obviously the top is not the same, but beautiful location and beautiful sunrise. We did the hike down. It's about a kilometer down to the fortress, castle, whatever you want to call it. Um, not too bad. There's steep parts as you can tell from my out of breathness. Um, but it's about a kilometer down and then the part across and up to the castle. So one thing to note is that you do actually need a reservation in order to do kind of the last part of the hike and get all the way down. Um, but if you go between 8 and 10 a.m., you do not. We were here a little bit before 8, so we had to wait for the gates to open at 8. Um, but otherwise, you'd have to book it several days or even further out. Um, like for us, we couldn't book yesterday for today, and we didn't know that till we looked it up yesterday. So um, luckily, we got here early. It was pretty quiet in the morning and we were able to see what we wanted but thing to note if you're planning on coming in the afternoon or later on in the day that you do need to reserve it is free but you just have to like book your time slot so there's not too many people we did it we made it back to our car and then we just moved to a different parking lot because the one we were at was pretty hectic and we were trying to get in and out and waiting for our spots so i didn't get to show you our our sweaty backs um from the hike back up it is just really really humid it's like 75 um, at 10 a.m. and 70% humidity um, and it there's no air movement outside so the hike back is kind of through like a wooded area so it's just really hot um, but definitely very doable and 100% worth it and I also have a bunch of really fun bug bites so that's cool I think they're mosquitoes for the most part, or no see um, I got a lot of them in Gijon because we had to sleep with the windows open because there was no AC um, and there's not screens. But I've been getting one or two every single night, so really adding to my collection. I'm gonna have one on my neck too.
And now we're going to enjoy a little coastal day. We're just going to head around the coast from here um, west, basically, and go to a few rocky beaches and take a little bit easy today and just explore slowly. grocery run or I'm gonna go get some anti-itch cream and then we're gonna go pick up some dinner we're gonna do some pizza and enjoy it at our last night in this Airbnb high tech little robot lawnmower a little pit stop at the pool before we go get dinner just take some photos this 84 feels a lot different than the 72 this morning yep Oh wow, there was lightning. What? There was lightning. So on this side, it looks like it's gonna storm. Maybe it and is. And over there, it looks about 90. Maybe the temperature is. We're heading into the town of Mungia to pick up some dinner. As we were waiting for our pizza, it started absolutely downpouring outside and there's nowhere to eat inside the pizza place since it's just a pickup spot. So we're gonna see if we can wait it out. So we've been going from awning to awning, trying to stay dry because we parked pretty far away. After waiting, waiting and waiting, we decided to make a run for it. I think you can tell by our outfits. Um, pizza is secured and we're heading back to our Airbnb. But it is pouring rain even though the forecast said it's 83 and sunny. No chance of rain. And now it looks like it never rained. We're gonna enjoy our pizza night in and our last night in Bilbao and the Basque Country before we head to Madrid tomorrow. <laughs> 